Hi everybody, it's Mark from Swift Bros Gear. It's good to be back with you today. We are gonna take a look at a brand new Helix preset and it is for the Dr. Z Route 66. Let's get right into it. So if you aren't familiar with the Route 66, it is a single channel amplifier with no master volume. Um, recently discontinued as of February 2018, three control knobs in total, a treble, a bass, and the channel volume. It operates exactly like you'd think on the volume control, lots and lots of clean headroom. Once you get past about 12 o'clock, you get a decent amount of breakup. The tone controls are a little different. The bass and treble both operate normally up until about 12 o'clock, and then add saturation and gain as you pass that point. Um, meaning that this amp is incredibly versatile. The model of this amp in the Helix is actually quite different from the real life amp. In the real life amp, again, three controls, bass, treble, volume. The model version has the full array of what you'd expect in terms of controls from a Helix, including bass, middle, treble, presence, channel volume, master volume, sag, hum, ripple, bias, uh, which actually gives us a ton of possibilities for this one amp model. So let's take a look at the preset we've got. All right, so here's the preset. It's fairly simple and straightforward. No super duper tricky stuff going on. Um, just a volume into a wah, into a compressor, into some gain staging and the amp coming out into two cabs, delay on one side, reverb on both. I will be playing through my Fender Elite Strat. Uh, that's the HSS with the Shaw Bucker in it. And here's what it sounds like. Now that's really, really wet. We'll take the reverb off for just a second so you can get a better idea of actually what this preset does sound like. And this is in position four. And I've set this up as a clean preset that you can sort of um, just drive with pedals. I did not really push the amp model to the you know edge of breakup in this one because I actually really 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 enjoy the clean sound of this amp. So here's the Shaw Bucker. Okay and position two. And I just love that um, I love that that bright and twanginess to it. It's it's almost as if uh, it's not quite Vox like and it's a it's brighter and a little bit twangier than a Fender. It's almost like a, the, it's almost like if a Vox and a Fender had a kid. So here's the middle position, position four, and here's the neck pickup. So I think one of the ways that this amp model actually really shines um, is in its ability to work with the model dirt pedals that are in the Helix. So in this particular one, I have the Kinky Boost, a Timmy, and the Valve Driver. Um, they all sound a little bit different. As I did in, in pretty much all of my presets, um, I set it up with multiple drives so you can stack them. And I, I really think that, you know, individual drive pedals have a voice to them. Um, and that voice might be nice, but if you can get a wider sweep of the EQ, you end up with just this wonderfully full sound. All right, so here's what it sounds like with the valve driver. Okay, all right, here's our Timmy. 
Again, a little bit of dirt, but different character. So if we turn on the kinky boost, it throws in more of the lower mids and you end up with a bluesy-ish sound. All right, and then again, where these really start to sound good is if you put them together. So let's put the kinky boost and the Timmy together. And this is not quite in tune. I'm gonna go ahead and tune again. All right, so let's listen to the two of them together. That's the neck position. Let's go over to the humbucker. In between positions, there's two, here's four, here's our middle pickup. Okay, and now let's just just to show you what it can sound like, let's go ahead and turn on the valve driver again. So that adds some to it. Right, if you listen to the listen to the breakup as as the notes ring. Right. Actually, let's, let's do it in the bridge. Right? Definitely brings in some of the more of the upper mid range. So this preset and all of the other Helix presets that I have put out are available on my website to download for free. I do accept and appreciate PayPal donations. There's a link on the website for that as well. The website is swiftbrosgear.com. Um, if you click down below, there'll be a link both to the website, my Facebook, Instagram page, and the uh, direct link to the page where you can download the preset from. Um, hope you enjoyed it. Thanks for sticking around to the end. And until next time, play what you love and love what you play. See you later.